When COVID-19 vaccines became widely available and economies around the world got back up and running, inflation just about everywhere started to spike. The U.S. Federal Reserve rose the cost of borrowing money in order to slow demand and stabilize prices. This was Fed Chair Jerome Powell in summer 2022. Inflation has obviously surprised to the upside over the past year, and further surprises could be in store. The Fed's preferred measure of inflation hit its peak at 6.8% in June of that year. Now it's down to 2.5%. This was Powell just two weeks ago. My confidence has grown that inflation is on a sustainable path back to 2%. On September 18th, the Fed is expected to announce a quarter point cut to the federal funds rate, which guides all other interest rates, mortgage rates especially. The average 30-year fixed-rate mortgage hit 8% in fall of 2023. Now they're below 6.5%. If we continue to see that kind of movement, I think we will uh, perhaps see some improvement in home sales and with that, some modest improvement in housing affordability. The cost of car loans will also start to decrease. So will credit card interest rates on new purchases, but since those annual percentage rates are already so high, typically well over 20%, September's likely cut won't make much of a difference. If someone were to maintain, let's say, a balance, which is totally inadvisable, uh, of let's say $5,000 and only make the minimum payment over a long period of time, that's only going to make a difference of about one or $200. The silver lining of the Fed's benchmark rate still being high relative to the past three decades is people can still take advantage of the returns of a high yield savings account, in some cases, more than 5% a year. After the Fed makes its first cut, decisions about future cuts will be based on where the unemployment rate goes and how the overall economy performs. If unemployment goes up and economic activity loses steam, the Fed would likely make bigger cuts at a faster pace. In Washington, I'm Atrell Nashar.